about once or twice a month, a really fantastic Sovereign Citizen video comes out. Well, let me tell you, on August 10th of this month, Van Bayon released a video which is pure gold. Though the appropriate word here may be free man on the land because this takes place in Great Britain. I'm telling you, you guys may have already seen this video, but I loved it. It was hilarious. We've got a British P. Barnes. We got the Magna Carta. We got the right to travel and some hilarious courtroom action. Thank you everyone for tuning in to Attorney Audits Agitator. I'm your host, Joe Palmetto, Joe the Lawyer. If you like my content, please like, subscribe, comment, and share. Also, I wrote a book called Sovereign Citizens. The link is in the description below. Finally, check out my friend Chief Tuttle's YouTube channel. It, it's called The Country Cop. Chief Tuttle was a cop uh, out in rural America for many years, and he's just got this great video talking about what the police life is like out there. There. So thank you for tuning in. Before we watch this video, raise your cup, your glass, your chalice, your stein, whatever it is you drink out of in the air and cheers with me because it tastes better when we sip together. We're here for justice. Cheers. <sighs> Delicious. And you, as you go in, you'll sit on the left, yeah? Hello, am I entering into this room today with my inalienable human rights? Can you remember me? No, no, it's not a courtroom because it's not a court of law because it's not a court of record, is it? We discussed this last time I was here, didn't we? So I come into court, don't have my human rights upheld. So you're telling me I'm entering into this room today without any human rights? Is that what you're telling me in here? You're not saying anything to me. So I'm entering into this room today with my human rights. Thank you very much. Come on, my lady. Yes, she can because she is my witness to what you are trying to do to me today. She is my witness and I have a child. I don't have any other option. I apologise. I don't have a child. I don't have any other option but to bring my child with me because I can't afford childcare. I apologise. I'm sorry. The child will be silent. Nobody told me this downstairs. Now, can you please come into the courtroom? I won't give you jurisdiction over me today. I am not a fictional character. And then what will happen? You'll do it without me here in my absence? No, sir, I won't allow you to do that in my absence. I'm sorry. I, I, I want to come in with my human rights, buddy. I'm entitled to human rights, yeah? I need people like you to stand by me and say we've got human rights because these people are taking away our human rights today. While we deal with the case, or you'll be asked to leave. So I keep quiet, that means I'm not allowed to put my opinion forward and not have the human rights, mate. And I'm not allowed to bring my witness in, so they're trying to get me to go in here without a witness, so they can do what they want to do without me having it. Do you have your oath with you today, by the way? Sorry, I forgot to ask, have you got your oath with you today? You know the one that you took to a hold? I can't know because you're going to no because they're going to do no no because they're going they're going to do my case without me present which is illegal and I won't allow them to do. Are you asking me to leave the court or are you telling me? You're telling me. You're telling me. You will be forcibly removed. I will be for, so you're going to assault me. Are you going to assault? Are you going to assault me to remove me from this court? Yeah, you've asked me to be removed, and I've asked for my oath, and they've abandoned court now. Anyway, they've abandoned court by leaving the back of the room. So when they have abandoned court, that now means I have power of the court. You have assaulted me! Get off me! You have assaulted me! That's assault. That's assault. After I've been assaulted. After I've been assaulted. You were told I've been assaulted. You were to leave. Yes, and then I was assaulted when I refused. And you I was assaulted when I was refused. Court, I, I can physically remove you. Can you can physically remove me. Yeah, and the court. judge has left the room, so therefore that court, that court is now no longer in practice because they have left the courtroom. Yeah, I mean, therefore, the court. therefore that courtroom is now null and void, and you cannot try yeah, carry on. With, if you bill. carry on with my case now in yes, there, this will be treason. Okay, Article 61 of the Magna Carta. Article 1215 is in effect brought into effect by the barons. Okay, can I just now you can, okay. yeah, in 91. The camera is on, everything's been recorded, okay? Yeah, My apart protection, from the note, your protection, nobody else's protection. Yeah. Okay, I've overheard, and I'm a witness in this case, I've yes. overheard you being asked to leave the courthouse. Yes, okay? leave, not told, so asked. 
Asked. Yes. Asked. No, I was asked. I was asked. They asked me. They asked me. I like it. She's smiling over there. She knows the truth. You all know the truth. You all know what Magna Carta is, don't you? What, what, what can we do to get you to leave here now? By getting me signed on the top of this to say I'm no longer on bail. That's what you can do. I'm not, not on bail. You've never been on bail. This is what you've this been... says here. This is what this says here. I have notice of grant of bail. That case is now finished. That case cannot go on because they ran out the back of the room when I asked them for their oath. Okay? okay? When I asked them for their oath, they pooped themselves and ran off. That's what happened. There's obviously they're not happy to continue. Yeah, yeah, because they want because to do your behaviour. Because they want to okay. do treasonous rules. No. Yeah? Okay, yeah, you're right. It's sedition until I tell them that they're under Article 61 was invoked okay. by the barons. The magistrates have decided in 2001, that they're not hear 23rd of March. With your present because of your behaviour. So therefore, you need to calm down and leave the court house. If you have any issues with their decisions, you need to address that. But then you're but going to this, cause me now harm. Now is the place to do that. Now you've been told to leave the court. But they are going to cause me harm by removing my right to travel. Yeah? I have a human right to travel on the highways, right. unhindered. Okay. And when you take my driving licence off me, I will be hindered I by you. Thing, I, I will be hindered by you guys continually. That is I why I'm not I leaving think, here today think, until this is resolved. Thing you need to do is allow the court to decide how they're going to proceed with the matter. No, okay? because that is then, then giving the jurisdiction that, over me. I'm not a fictional well, character. They, they, they I'm they a human a right. being. They I have, have a right. right. They're called human rights. Yeah, okay. They have yeah, a right and you're not allowing me my human rights. Okay. I've asked you gen yeah, no, I'm, 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 I'm replying politely. I'm now going to ask you to leave See, the now you're going to taking, assault me. I'm taking hold so of I, you. So no, 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 no. This is okay. assault. This no, is no. assault. You've been asked. This is assault. You've been asked to leave the court. This is assault. This is assault. I'm asking no, you to leave assault. the court. No, this is assault. And carry on with my case without me. I don't want to arrest you for being... No, no, but you're going to carry on with my case. I'm not... So please leave the court. But now you're going to carry on with my case without me. I don't yeah? want to have to No, no, no. You. I want to be in there. So they, the court. If they carry on with my case without me and you take away my licence today, you will cause harm to me. I will not allow harm to come to myself or my family. This is wrong. This is bloody treason. And this video is going all over Facebook as soon as I get home. I want this removed. I don't want to be on bail anymore. Please you are leave, not dealing with that. Court. This is assault, officer. Ow! This is assault. Don't push me through this radiating thing. I want to go around it. I want to go around it, you're assaulting me. Okay. This is hard. Why the fuck are you doing this to me? Why are you doing this to me? You're taking away my right to travel. You're taking away my right to travel. Otherwise you're going to be arrested for the further offence. Okay. It's an offence. No, it's not a crime. What crime have I committed? What crime have I committed? What crime have I committed? When I said we were going to see the British P. Barnes, okay, maybe I exaggerated a little bit, but in the classic P. Barnes Sovereign Citizen video, a sovereign citizen gets tased right outside the courtroom because he keeps going in. He is being uh, erratic and hostile and harassing in the courtroom, and the courtroom bailiff just takes care of him. Here, not quite the same scenario, but we do have a guy going into a courtroom being a total jag off. I mean, this guy is trying to bring his baby into the courtroom, bringing a baby into the courtroom that while at the same time at yelling at the judge, the lawyers, okay, and, and the courtroom staff and agitating the bailiff. What a total jag off. You know what this was? The, the baby was a hostage. The baby was a human shield almost. He's bringing the baby in, okay, to protect it himself so that the, so that the police can't arrest him or throw him out because he knows he's going to go in and harass these poor people. We are talking lunacy here, folks. Lunacy. Too bad that judge couldn't have just reached down and ordered a mental health exam for this guy. He says, I'm entering my room within inalienable rights. Yeah, so is everybody else. One thing that most people don't know and you should know, and the Supreme Court of the United States has talked about this, all right? When you commit a crime, you actually lose some of your rights. When you're in jail, you lose your rights. When you're in prison, you lose your rights. So you're in, everybody else walks in there with their inalienable rights too, dude, dude okay? So, oh, I'm gonna entering my, the room with my human rights, bringing a child in. Like I said, the baby's a hostage. The baby's a hostage. You're get, come on, man. He then tells him, no jurisdiction, I'm not a fictional character. Actually, dude, you are a fictional character. Uh, okay, you may be, you may be a flesh and blood human being, but your brain and the ideas that you have, pure 100% fiction. Dr. Seuss, right out of Looney Bin, buddy, right out of there. Uh, he talks about the oath. That's another sign that this is a sovereign citizen. This is an agitator. This is an idiot. 
Uh, then he talks about being forcibly removed and this officer keeps touching him, pushing him along. You crazy? Assault, assault. No, actually it's not assault when you are being detained or placed in, under arrest, okay? Or you're being removed from property that is not your own. Not salt, buddy, not salt. We need a middle time, same time sit, hang on. Ah, coffee's just so good right now. Um, you assaulted me, you assaulted me. Uh, asked to leave he says oh i was asked to leave not told okay the officer said you were asked to leave that see that's the trick that sovereign citizens play they jump on these tiny little differences in words listen buddy it doesn't matter in this context you're going you're going you're getting out of there and then wait for it okay that it, it got better progressively because he eventually gets thrown out all right but he cites the Magna Carta. I love the Magna Carta. You guys tell me, what do you like better? When uh, when the Magna Carta is cited, Black's Law Dictionary, or the UCC? I mean, well, maybe the most ridiculous of them all, though the Magna Carta is a sacred document for historical purposes, has a lot of meaning. But uh, when you gotta reach back 500 years for your law, you know something's gone wrong, all right? Uh, and then he mentioned, and then he invokes the barons, and then he invokes the English barons, all right, which uh, is actually kind of cool. I like that quote. <laughs> Are you a baron or do you have a lineage of a baron? That's what I want to know, buddy. Otherwise, shut the heck up. You're a peasant. You're an English peasant. That's what you appear to be. Um, and then, and then to top it all off, to top it all off, the human right of the day, the human, the right to travel. Sure, you do have the right to peaceably move around the world, all right? Uh, on foot, on foot, you don't have the right to a driver's license, you mo. Unbelievable, unbelievable, hilarious. This is a great video. This is Sovereign Citizen Gold, and it just highlights how loony these people are bringing a baby and that's just sad and tragic man sad and tragic all right everybody thank you for joining attorney audit agitators joe palmetto joe the lawyer sip with me it tastes better buy my book it's in the description below and check out my man chief tuttle the country cop link is below and shout out to van bayon for uploading this video you everyone else have a great day